The microbiome is basically all the microorganisms that live on and in our body. So fungus, bacteria, viruses, other organisms that live with us and go through life with us. And the microbiome recently has become really exciting because we've realized that it's not just that these organisms are passive passengers on our body, uh, and they're not just things that cause disease, they're things that actually help us um, interact with us and may help us develop who we are and, and really how our health is overall. It turns out that our microbiome is in flux uh, all the time and we can help it, help mold it to give us the best health that we can have. Five tips to keep the microbiome healthy, particularly your gut microbiota. So first, healthy diet, and this is uh, lots of fruits and vegetables, low animal fats, low animal products. Two, exercise, keeping your body healthy will keep, help keep your gut healthy and their microbiome healthy. Three, um, reducing your stress if you can. We know that stress is gonna negatively impact your microbiome and you can have reductions of some of the good bacteria that you want. Four, if you can stay away from antibiotics, do so. Only take antibiotics when you have an infection that really needs to be treated with antibiotics because they can reduce the diversity of your microbiome and that can be a problem in health. And finally, people ask about probiotics, prebiotics. Um, these are things that may be helpful in particular diseases or disorders, but if you're perfectly healthy and you're doing all those other four things, you probably don't need to add it on just because. Use them uh, only if you need to. Oh.